Hello guys, welcome back for another episode of Unique Items and Weapons in Oblivion. Today we're going to be finding unique boots and shoes. First up is Nystor's boots located in Best Goods and Guarantees. So enter through this gate here, which is the, the northeast gate, and you can walk on down pretty simply. So coming into Leowen, northeast gate. So let's head on inside and purchase the boots. So once inside, you locate the woman and speak to her. Go into our barter, look down at the boots, and there they are. So purchase them. Thank they're in your inventory. We're now going to show you some effects of Nicer's boots. Some of Nicer's boots' abilities are water breathing on self, fortify speed, and athletics on self. This is an alternative to Fin Gleam. However, Fin Gleam may be free, but harder to find. Nystor's boots will always be located in Best Goods and Guarantees, but for a price. So these boots basically give you quite amphibian-like properties and allow you to breathe underwater whilst fortifying your speed and athletics. Olympic swimmers, beware. The next item on our list is the Boots of Swift Merchant. These can be found in Chorl. Once in, take a left and head for the shop in the corner. Northern Goods and Trade. Once inside, speak to the merchant. Beware. If you do not have over 50 mercantile, the trader will not have it in their inventory. So you must be level 50 or above to get the boots. So head on upstairs and speak to the merchant, Seedneus. Only the finest wear. So enter our barter May I and search for boots of the swift merchant. Fine. We'll now show you these boots in action. I appreciate your business. Okay, so the boots of the Swift Merchant are considered light armor and fortify mercantile speed craft and speed on self. However, they have two major drawbacks in the form of weakness to disease and poison. They have a constant effect on the player. This basically means that you can barter better deals and persuade people easier. Well, I would recommend getting these boots. Let's do business. Okay, so the final boots which we're going to be covering today are located in the Imperial City Market District. Fast travel and you should appear on this part of the map. Simply go up and turn right and head towards Divine Elegance to find the Quicksilver Boots. We're going to head on inside and purchase these boots. However, please note that you need 50 mercantile skill in order for them to appear inside her inventory. You've come to do Once on the shopkeeper May you speak to her, you in some of my go down ways. and there they are. I wouldn't make that deal with just anybody. They're quite expensive but well worth it. We're now going to show you some of the effects of the Quicksilver Boots. I appreciate your business. The effects of the Quicksilver Boots are as follows. They fortify your agility and speed. However, they drain your heavy armor and light armor. These boots are classed as light armor. Basically, this makes it handy in combat, as you're a lot faster than any other of the rival races in Oblivion. I suggest you look these boots up, however, they are quite expensive. The unique items we've recovered today include Nystor's boots, boots of the swift merchant, and quicksilver boots, in addition to the three helms we found last episode. Next episode we'll be finding more unique items for you guys to pick up in Tamriel. Please like, watch, rate, and subscribe. And check out our next video on bloopers of this episode. Coming soon.